In today's video, I'm going to teach you how to mute all participants in a Microsoft Teams meeting. Managing your meetings effectively is crucial, especially when you have multiple participants. Muting everyone can help maintain order and reduce background noise, allowing your meeting to run smoothly. So let's walk through the process step by step. First things first, you'll need to sign into your Microsoft Teams account. This is your gateway to organizing and managing your meetings. Make sure you have your login details handy. And once you've signed in, you should be directed to the main dashboard. This is where you'll have access to all your calendar events, previous chats, and of course the meeting functions we are focusing on today. Once you're signed in, look for the video icon on your Teams dashboard. Clicking this icon will take you to the meeting interface. Before moving forward, ensure that you have a stable internet connection to avoid any disruptions during your meeting setup. In the next step, you will initiate the meeting by clicking on Start Meeting. This option usually appears as a button that allows you to begin your session, either instantly or as scheduled. If you're planning ahead, you can also schedule a meeting for a later time. Teams makes this process simple. With your meeting started, you'll notice several options available within the interface. One of these is the people icon, often represented by two silhouettes or a similar graphic. Clicking on this icon will open a side panel displaying a list of all participants currently in your meeting. At this point, if you have participants already joined, you'll see them listed. Here you can manage individual audio settings. For instance, if someone was inadvertently unmuted, you can quickly intervene. But our focus today is on muting everyone at once. In the participant pane, look for the option labelled Mute All. This feature is a lifesaver in larger meetings, as it allows you to instantly mute all attendees, preventing any unwanted interruptions from background noise. It's important to note that if no one else has joined your meeting yet, the Mute All button might not be available, as there aren't any participants to mute. Microsoft Teams is designed to streamline your meeting management, so options will often only appear when they're applicable. In summary, signing into Teams, starting a meeting, and navigating to the People icon are your key steps. From there, using the Mute All function keeps your meeting running efficiently. Practice makes perfect, so don't hesitate to familiarize yourself with these steps ahead of time. This preparation will ensure that when you need to act quickly in a live meeting, you'll be ready. Thank you for joining me today to learn this valuable skill. I hope you found this guide helpful for your future meetings on Microsoft Teams.